talk about this new book that we borrowed from the library. It's called Spoon Book. Yeah, Spoon. Two, three, four, five, six. Good job. Okay, I'm done. All right, Jonah. First, we're going to start this challenge. Which of these utensils are spoons? What's it's that one for? What's this? That's for pasta. That's for pasta. That's a pasta claw. Is that a spoon? No. What is that? This is a fork. That's a fork. You can eat pasta with a fork. Is that a spoon? Yeah. It is a spoon. What can you eat with a spoon? I eat pasta. You can eat pasta if you try hard. You can eat cereal. How about ice cream? And what's that? Spoon ice cream. <laughs> That's a big ice cream spoon. Yeah. Good job. Let's get started. So this is Spoon. Throughout the story, he has a little bit of an identity crisis. He has a family Spoon. This is Spoon's family. And throughout the book, he talks about the different things that he wishes that he could do, just like his friends. The fork, the knife, and the chopsticks. He wishes he could do cool things like the knife or things like the fork, or things like the chopstick. The best part about this book is that Spoon learns what's special about him. I love Spoons! So check out Spoon, written by Amy Krause Rosenthal and illustrated by Scott Magoon.